Okay, so here we are, Al. Uh, tra Hi. Traveling north over the Fort Ward Bridge. Yep, we are. We are. We're heading north for a few days of fishing on the River Spray. And it's an annual pilgrimage that we make. And, uh, you know, we're kind of just, we're just coming down into it. We're not even in the zone. We're not, we can't even see the zone at the moment. We're just, we're still in Edinburgh City stuff. You know the score, you're kind of a bit tense as all. Well. We're just coming down slowly. We haven't even got the music on yet. No music I mean, we don't even know what we're going to listen to. <laughs> we're at that <laughs> stage. <laughs> oh, when I walk down the river bank, I wanted where I stood. I looked at the trees that are coming out the head. And I'm looking at my net. She stood in the bushes. I'm looking at me. I'm looking down the river, seeing what she could see. Sea trout. That was a huge fish. Honestly, that was a massive fish. Sea trout because they are the silver wolves of the water. You hunt for them at night. They're elusive during the day. They require a certain stealth. I think it's about, it's about getting back to pitting your wits against something in an unfamiliar environment. Okay, well, Al has taken to the water now, and I have to say it's just a pleasure to watch my friend, who's a consummate fly fisherman, casting a line on the spay here. I think the spay is, the spay is a unique river, and with the spay there's a drifting mystery around, around my rod. Just watching him sneaking the fly over this pool where we saw that salmon jumping. It all lunged, it didn't come out of the water, it just sort of pushed a volume of a tidal wave of water beyond it. It's rather a cheeky little salmon that's just risen off the end of the stones down there. And uh, I think his number's up, basically. Name on a towel, you have your name on it for the evening. Mm -hmm.